I'm here with my good friend Rabbi Glazerson, who has enormous amounts of patience to do what he does in creating these Torah codes, and I'm sure you've seen his website where he has hundreds of these, literally, up on YouTube. And he does them on every topic pretty much imaginable, and he's also featured in the Torah code Into Darkness film, which uh, came out about a year ago, and we're already trying to work on another one. I mean, that's yeah, something that we're yeah, trying to we do. That we have the people to help. Yeah. And so uh, that just requires us uh, to get the money together to do that, and that's what we're doing right now, to try to figure out how to do that the best way. But he did a table uh, for me again today, which is very humbling, actually, because it mentions Torah Code and my company name, Pinlight, uh, let us and why don't you explain and what this table And also it's interesting means. that this table you can see in red, Torah code. And what is interesting is that you have pin light, that might be, with the smallest skip, which you said is very, very significant. Well, when he means by that, the small skip, it's like we're talking about, again, like we do in the film, equidistant letter sequencing, which is skipping letters to find other words in the Torah, and in the word pinlight, what was the skip? It is four. Four only letters. Four letter, only four letters. So you wouldn't even need a computer yeah, if you knew where to look yeah, to find letters, the name pinlight. Yeah, definitely. It's very... Now, what is interesting... That under under pin light you have a small skip of this seal, five seven seven six. Yeah, that's the Hebrew yeah. calendar word yeah. for 2016. So this clearly shows that pin light is a very important uh, task, destiny on this seal to bring more more to our cause. Now, really, you have here you can see on the right five seven seven five Tavshina and Hey, which really we did the previous. Uh, it's when the phone came uh, out. Yeah, right, right. Now also what we have here on the same line of pin light, you have ephod and ephod, as we showed already in one of the watchers. Yes. That ephod are connected with codes. Both and, of them. and ephod's kind of interesting because it was a device that the high priest wore that lit up when you asked it questions. Exactly. So we're kind of postulating, could the Torah code be the modern ephod? We've exactly. mentioned that before, even in Watchers we mentioned yeah, that. The watchers, right, right. But um, in this case, it is very interesting. Maybe the ephod was a device that had some kind of technology that we don't understand don't today. We knew it was a divine thing. Now also what is important is that we have like a sentence, the purpose of pin lights, the purpose of Torah code, is to show to the world the deeds of God, because the Torah was a blueprint of creation, which means that everything which is in the Torah, it was planned, and really with our deeds, and uh, free choice. But when we behave in different ways, we have different tables. I mean, this is the idea of yeah. the That's thoughts, which were only the written Torah, not in the Bible, not yeah. in the... You no, know, this is amazing to me. It's. Uh, uh, very humbling and exciting to think that we'd have anything to do with showing the world the deeds of God. But I mean, if that's what we're supposed to do, it's it's a great thing. But you've also done a couple other really interesting tables, which uh, blew my mind. This one here, uh, because this is on all the news today about Hillary Clinton being sick. And so we thought we'd see if there was a table about that, and tell me how you, what you found here. So it's amazing that only once in the Torah it appeared that Hillary is sick. Also very interesting. In a full sentence, Hillary is sick with the yeah, same many, many skip. Bit, right, right, the same, the same skip, once in the Torah, yeah? Sick. Now what is the sickness of Hillary? Also indication you have here, Within Bedaleket, when she is sick, Chola, when she is sick, Hillary is sick with infection. Which one? You have on the left side, Reot, Bedaleket Reot. So, Lungs, yeah, which is with infection. Weren't you telling me that that's the word in, in Hebrew, Hebrew for, for pneumonia? Yeah, in right. English is pneumonia. In Hebrew, you say Daleket, it is infection. Which kind of infection? Of the Reot. And this is exactly what you have here. You have here. Bedaleket, because it's written Chola, Hillary Chola, with what? Right. With infection, now which one? Minimal in the Torah, lungs, the heart. And also we have the ear, we have five, seven, seven, six, which is this ear. Right. And also, by the way, we have the woman to tell you that she is a woman. Yeah, that's really, and that's close to her sentence, sick Hillary. Really amazing. 
So what uh, what was the skip on Sick Hillary? It's it's a pretty large skip, was yeah, it? Yeah, because yeah, because it's in in the Torah, one's in the Torah, and yeah. many letters. You can see on the left side is written there, hundred and thirteen eighty five. It means from which letter? Letter is is hundred and thirteen eighty five. 13, 11, 11, 11,385 exactly, yeah. letters, yeah. yeah. So because it is... But it's a complete sentence with exactly, both words exactly, in it, exactly, which, you know... Right, and it is also the best meeting with the Daleket mm -hmm. and, and with Ear also. Right. Yeah. Now this other one is really, I don't know, I find this one really, really incredible because, uh, I, I mean, it'll make a lot of people angry, but... Here it is. Anyway, yeah, you you've see, got an enormous <laughs> sentence in this. Yeah, so you have to analyze to show clearly. Now, the first thing I have to emphasize that this, the basis of this finding is by a site which is called Kilashem Anucha. That's the kingdom is to God. Very interesting site. And there I found the, as you can see from the beginning, which is in Hebrew, to Avat Hashem. The abomination under the Lord of Asota Brit, of the United States, in one sentence, unbelievable, yeah? Yeah. And they found, it's a continuation, is, Ma yesh libam, like, Ma, what, yesh, what there is in their heart. Yeah, what is their heart? Yeah. They are defiled, and the and United States comes in right, yeah, right across right. that word, they are defiled. And then the abomination unto the abominable unto the Lord, uh, and all of this is in the same skip in the same exactly. sentence, all which is same, which is very very highly significant because. Uh, well, yeah, but when you show this to me, and then we realize that in the plain text yeah, down below, exactly the same. It says an abomination unto the Lord thy exactly, God. Exactly. Exactly. So. Very important that in, in Torah course you should use the right words. Yeah. Unfortunately, you know, all those who are doing tables put yeah, words without, yeah. you must be the proper sentence. So this table was found in the book of Deuteronomy? Or yeah, in more no, than no, no, in few, in few, because it's such a distance, it must be in many. Oh. You see, you can see it really. But the plain from text. Ale, from Genesis, it goes up to Deuteronomy. But the see. plain text was found in yeah, Deuteronomy. Yeah, right, right, the plain text. Now, also, very important to point out, Obama and Hillary, you can see this is what I found. After seeing their table, I saw that Obama and Hillary, you can see Hillary in red and Obama in uh, yellow, really, really like... Uh, They're like intertwined with exactly, each other. Exactly, exactly. Which is Which really... Is definitely also very that's pretty crazy. And showing the connection definitely of their deeds, you know. Also, by the way, on top you have a very small skip, letter after letter, of this year, 776, which itself it is uh, quite uh, significant. Well, I know uh, this whole code table tees off of the bottom here where it says, cursed will be the taker of yeah. bribery. Now, exactly. is that plain text? Yeah, or is it's that plain, no, it is plain text. It's plain it's text. text. Yeah, plain text. Plain text, right. right. And uh, also, by the way, you have to emphasize the left, you know. You have the left side. The left, Because you know yeah. quite well that... Uh, you know, there's the left, uh, this is a side, the left wing, really, very much with this. Uh, now, side. is this also in Deuteronomy? Cursed will be the taker of bribery? Or yeah, yeah, also in Deuteronomy, it? yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. One can see clearly where is the place, you see, in Hebrew, you have, yeah, yeah, right, right. Oh, yeah. Both like, of yeah. them in Deuteronomy, right. But it starts from Genesis. <laughs> it starts from Genesis, going all, all over, up to finishing with... Yeah, so, the, so, so this table spans all five yeah, books, yeah, yeah. but the plain text that we're reading was from the yeah, book of Deuteronomy. Right, right, right. No, yeah. doubt. no that's pretty amazing. So definitely, is this well, it's amazing when you see that that in the code, the abomination unto the Lord, and then in the plain text, it says yeah, the exactly. same thing. Yeah, this which gives a lot of force to the finding. Yeah, the that doesn't happen very of often. Power. Right, and right. It, you're not forcing the table to exactly, do that. This exactly, is like, exactly. you know, it just happens. Exactly. This is what is very important about codes. Because even right. though, because other, all of us who are doing codes, you know, <laughs> put words, but no connection, not the right one. You know, take Hebrew words and bring them together, but it doesn't make sense, you know. The most important in table code like this is to show the right wordings, you know, yeah. right Hebrew words. 
and only this which makes it significant besides being minimal well, that's your great it? value i think is that you're able to word these phrases as as if they were written 33000 years ago exactly, exactly. and then then it makes sense because that's the way the book was written anyway i, I know that uh, this is wild stuff and thank you so much for it's pleasure. It's flying pleasure. all the way to Los Angeles yet again. <laughs> you do so often. Yeah, right. I feel it's very important, you know, that uh, I can see that people are very, you know, very eager, want very much, very thirsty to know what is going on, to yeah. see, to have meaning to it. And really, if you find it in the locations that are us, you, you saw here, you know, clearly there is a message from God what we should do. We should improve ourselves, really. And this is what will bring the Messiah, you know. <laughs> and meanwhile, you can see the original film, Torah Code's End to Darkness, on Vimeo. Hope you uh, check it out.